Lui le doce at it again. Lui le doce senior brother le doce is at it again. There is no way you can say that this man le doce is he for real or if he's just faking everything like his younger brother. Lui le doce. Shame kuna welcome back again to my channel. This is Tennis Media TV. But my old and new subscribers feel less uncomfortable. Get better just for you guys today. My correct people, my Obonga people, you don't see how everything unfolds, how everything is going, how the story of a Doche family is unfolding every day by day. With the way Lee Doche is talking about peace, when we made, needed the peace, you guys betrayed her. You guys take, took her for granted. I want to say which kind of peace are you talking about? When a brother betrayed her in is in such a painful way, in a way that even if she be like to marry again, she will say no. That maybe she will marry you little che promise. That's it. We don't they check her mother say, okay, look at me. Do you see we may have someone that have issue? Many fans, many netizens were like, it seems that we may you know they give you the Doche peace of mind. That's why he married second wife. Then there is an argument like, you see that Judy Austin is the one giving you the Doche peace of mind. Someone that is doing all this rubbish on social media, posting anyhow on social media. Do you think? She is the one giving you the deep peace of mind. Even if your first wife not give you peace of mind, marrying second wife wouldn't give you the chance and hundred percent sure that you will get the peace of mind that you needed. Peace of mind now God they give them, not be human being. No. Not be human being they give peace of mind. I don't talk this thing and that we keep saying it that. Judy, we may is such a responsible woman. You can't just point accusing fingers on her, say that she is not a good person. That she even married the wrong person. That's why it seems that she is not a good person. You little chief for me decided to marry second wife. He decided to marry someone that he impregnated. That's his choice to marry someone that he impregnated. Not that the thing came up to him suddenly to marry second wife, but it seems like he has no choice again. That's why he ended up saying that he will marry someone that he impregnated. I've said this several times that you Reduce made a very big mistake here. You impregnated a woman, okay, that's not all. But not a more that you will marry someone that you impregnated. What if that person is not a wife material type? You know, marriage is not a, something like you just enter and feel free. If you're not comfortable with marriage, you will lost peace of mind totally. That's it. Then him, do you marry to the person out of pity or out of many people or they said uh, you should? You will surely marry someone that you impregnated. Is a must. No, it's not in any constitution. You can take care of the person, but marrying that person is not a must. 